Prime salt ring light out. I haven't got a stand for it. I don't know where it is. And it literally just falls because, okay, now look at the state of that. This is without a ring light. Like it's quite dark, I think. So, yeah, because it's night time now. Well, I'm in my PJs. I don't know if you can see any food down them all right. You know, I've had these on, I'm sure, about five days straight. But, hang on. Um, right, I'll try and. I've got a candle from Home Bargains, so I'm going to try and prop it up with this. This is the um, Wickford and Co. chocolate orange, and it smells really nice. So, yeah, I had a. I posted it on Instagram. I had a chocolate orange. Has <gasps> that worked? Kind of. Okay, I can't move. And on my bed, it's quite wobbly. Can you, that's a bit annoying, isn't it? It's quite wobbly. For fuck's sake, hang on. I'll have to be, no, I don't like that. I have to look around the candle. Anyway, what I'm saying is, what do you call it? Oh, chocolate from Costa. <gasps> Nearly at the deck when she fucking said eight pound, eight pound 40, I think she said. Oh my God. I was like, okay, I've only just figured out that I can pay on my phone with my wallet. Cause the dog's chewed my bank card, you see. <laughs> I'm all out of bank cards. All right, so I thought, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Ran out of lecky, I needed to do something. So I figured it out on my old uh, phone. Got the wallet up, eh? Double tap the side. You know, recognises your face. Took me a while when I first out. Fucking did it at Tesco, didn't I? Do you know when you scan your club card? You scan it on the scanner, don't you? Not the card reader. So for ages, when I went to Tesco, <laughs> putting my phone to pay for me shopping, not the club card, like to pay for it on the um, way you do scan your club card. Not on the card reader. You know, you chip and pin and all that. It's fucking ages. She must have thought, what are you doing? Do you know what I mean? But, oh, so annoying. Right, I'll try and have it there. That's, oh, no, 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 no. Right. I don't want you to wobble. You probably are going to wobble a little bit. How's that? It's a bit dark, isn't it? It is a bit dark. I hope you've had a good day anyway. That is so much better. Just stay. Stay, stay like that. Please. Yeah, I hope you've had a good day. Oh my god. Okay, if I keep very still, it might stay there. But yeah. Oh. Right. Wait, who is she? There we go. That's all right. That is quite nice. If it is wobbler, I do apologise. I'm a big bird on a small bed, all right? And it's a bit wobbler, there's a lot going on. Okay, so, yeah, <laughs> don't mind that. But anyway, happy whatever day of the week it is. Hope you're all right, you've had a nice day. I feel like it is wobbling. Oh, I, I've got a load of like new Christmas decorations and a tree. We're currently propped on the tree, um, which I'll show you at the end, because yeah, everything's resting um, on this tree, so. Yeah, it's a shit show, honestly. It is a shit show. But I've been to Home Bargains and um yeah, I've got a Santa, I'm gonna show you him in a minute. But he was 16.99, I couldn't believe he was 16.99 from Home Bargains. I'm, I don't wanna be too loud because the kids' bedroom's like next door and I wanna surprise them tomorrow for after school. So I wanna get it all up. It's in my bedroom in a minute. I'm about to like get it through the house, um, you know, detective style not detective style like you know just secretive so everything's in my room and yeah I've, like tomorrow i'm gonna like get them off to school um mason's got swimming i need to remember swim shorts tonight when i'm packing his bag but yeah um tomorrow as soon as they get home from school well as soon as they've gone sorry i'm gonna like get it all up and um Surprise them for when they get home, you know. Usually I go for like randomness because I, I do love randomness and I'll just put anything and everything on a tree, you know. But I thought, you know what, I'm going to go for a theme. I've seen some beautiful trees. I really wanted to do the, um, what do I want to do? The candy cane lane, you know, like all the candy canes and like it's very Grinch like and I love the Grinch and it like really works. Like I've seen so many people online, so many people online. Um, do the candy cane tree and it looks stunning. Honestly, the amount of effort that people put into them trees, stunning. But firstly, my own bargains didn't have much. They had about five things, literally, like of the candy cane range. And 
I felt like each bit was quite expensive as well. So to do like all the big bits, I felt like that would have added up quite a bit. So yeah, I've got a tree. I've got a seven foot snowy tree, which I'll show you that in a minute. This was 59.99 on the tree, but I'll show you that. Um, so yeah, I'll show you that at the end because it's all like props on there. But I got like new decorations because I'm going for a theme this year. So I'm going for pink. I like pink, gold and silver. I know it sounds like there's too much going on with the gold and silver. It was originally going to be pink and gold, but the decorations that I got, um, they've got a bit of silver in as well. Like I've got some from Poundland, which I'll show you, I'm sure, at some point. But um, yeah, I could absolutely go crazy on this tree with random like pink bows and you know that just so many different like beautiful um, things, but they're so expensive individually you know for like you get like two items of like a really snazzy thing and it's really expensive once you do a few of them you know all around your tree it adds up so I just thought I'd get a few boxes of bits and then it's like an investment as well I think because these will like last me for years you know so yeah I'm excited well anyway I um I'll get into it now so if you do want to stick around I'd really appreciate it if you have to like and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and I shall get on with it. First thing I got is a candle. So this is the um, Wickford & Co chocolate orange. And when I tell you this smells like Terry's chocolate orange, oh, I can't get over that hot chocolate, you know. They had a Toblerone one or a Terry's chocolate orange. And I thought, when we're walking by on the screen, because they've got like the little screens in there showing you what's, you know, going on. Like, I never really go anywhere like this. Coupland's and Greg's, you know, I get the free coffee on my app every week. <laughs> You know, I take advantage of that now. I never used to, but I do now. So, like, it's O2 Rewards or something like that. And, um, yeah, I thought, oh, that looks really nice. And they don't have a price, you know, when they're showing you all this. So I went in and um, decided to have, you know, out of the Toblerone or the Terry's, the Terry's one, and she went £8, eight pounds something. And I'm like, okay, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Like, it, it was nice, but not not four pound nice you know but it was nice to be fair just yeah cost the coffee cost a lot but um yeah i got this candle so it smells amazing honestly i usually go for like the cinnamony ones but um oh, so nice so yeah i like them ones and then i got some red hair dye so this was 4.99 holly um said to get the um dingy one from home bog is this one and it goes straight on now on the back again you know it's not going to go with that color you know it isn't going to do that but i'm going to take the risk you know and just keep doing it until i get this color so yeah 4.99 you know i thought listen i got one in poundland for a pound it weren't two quid all right it weren't three quid it was a pound a box of red vibrant red hair dye so i'll whack it all on i will you know, see how we get on. Oh, pickled eggs. Pick it. Let's do a bit of ASMR. Oh, pickled eggs. Tyler won this thing in the arcade a couple of weeks ago, and I seen it on an ASMR video. And it's like um, like a weird, it's like a bug, but it makes a really weird noise. It's amazing. If you're into AS, if you're into ASMR, it's like a really nice trigger. I really like it. How did I go from that pickled eggs to that? But um, yeah, I got some. <clears throat> breathe girl drivers pickled eggs so i love anything pickled and then i got some gherkins as well so 89p the cheapest i can find them lidl's um cheap as well for gherkins so yeah i oh I fucking love pickled gherkins anything pickled to be honest and then i got some toothpaste we're running out so yeah just some max clean um toothpaste so i use that because i know i've had a few comments about it so i use the um what do I use? I use any old like Colgate. Not any old, I am a bit funny with toothpaste to be fair. Like my teeth aren't like white white but I'm really conscious of them because I've got like a white line going through one. Very conscious because I drink a lot of coffee. So quite often I'll like do a random extra two brushes in the day. I know it's not amazing because obviously you don't want to do it too much. I'll only do it, if I do extra ones in the day, it'll only be for like a minute or so, you know, because I don't want to take me enamel off, do you know what I mean? But yeah i just um yeah i get a bit like conscious of my teeth so yeah i use like colgate and i use the oh what is it called it's pink it's bright pink little triangle bottle pearl drops is it pearl drops like the pearly whites extra bright 
Pearl drops one. And it's like £1.49. I got mine from Savers, I think, or Home Bargains. I've still got loads left. But I brush my teeth with that and then, like, Colgate and then a bit of that every day. I got some crispy onions. I chuck these in a salad. They're really nice, honestly. These were only a quid. Quid? Who has that? Quid. <laughs> they're only a quid. So, yeah, I got these. Um, Mumbai crispy onions. Honestly, they're so nice in a salad. Just, you know... In Tesco, they're a bit pricier than that, I'm sure. And then ran out of pods, so I've got some surf winter warmth, and this smells really nice. So I'm <laughs> sniffing all of them in the bloody shop, and this kid just walked past me, give me a right look. That was two ninety nine. Honestly, I love it. And then oh, my favourite, I've got some um, Carex Cinemazing popcorn body wash. This stuff is unreal. Honestly, it is unreal. So, it smells a bit like feet, like a musty shoe, fusty shoe, but in a nice way, like a nice smelly foot. If that, <laughs> that makes sense. Do you know what I mean? It's like a weird popcorny foot smell. I've not got a weird foot fetish or anything. I mean, I like feet. Maybe I have actually, because I do like feet. Too much information, I'm telling you all your, your, your little secrets. Um, I've got some Dash Hound. Da oh, yeah, Dash Hound Through the Snow. Like dashing through the snow. <laughs> yeah, don't know what it smells like. Cinnamon sugar. Hey, oh, Lord, I didn't even read it. I just thought, oh, it's Christmassy. Oh, it does smell nice. It does. So, yeah, limited edition one. So I'll whip that out a week before Christmas. <laughs> And then, oh, I like these. A lot of people said they didn't like them. Well, I tried them. So they are the Skinny Noodles, 14 calories. 14 calories. Honestly, they've got the rice. I haven't tried the rice because I'm not a fan of rice, really. But I really liked them. So I put some soy sauce in them. What did I cook them with? Excuse me. I can't remember. Tofu. I had them with tofu and, um, you know, a bit of soy sauce in that. It says serves too, but I had the old packet. Did. didn't realise it said serve two. Well it was only 14 calories per serve. It says per hundred per 125 grams, so this is 380, so not fucking much, you know, but only a quid. Rubicon, so I've got some of that. And then these are gonna go on my tree. So they are pink and white candy canes. They're 199 for these. So honestly, I thought that would like the cheaper of the um, decorations because there's honestly there were so many fancy things like big like mask things and like fancy bows and all sorts they're like 4 99 each so you know just for like literally one or two and I thought that can get pricey you know so yeah I got these um, just you know to put around a few nice little bits and that is everything um, out of the bag listen are you ready okay my camera might wobble now it's a bit heavy you know I've got a Santa, you can't see him. It's a big one. Look, it's a big one. Can you see? This was sixteen ninety nine. All right, this is... I don't know how big he is. I don't know how big he is. Shall I get a thumbnail? Me and Santa, oh, that was a bit awkward, wasn't it? He's quite heavy. It's really, like, there's a few bits here and there, which I didn't notice until after, like, the glue stuck on. I need to tighten this ribbon. You know, but overall, look, it's not bad, is it? So, yeah, I'm well sure for that. I'm going to have that stood next to my tree. Hopefully crash. Oh, these are little boots. Hopefully crash don't um, knock him out, you know. But, yeah, what, 16 99 Yeah, I've got for... Fo this is where, like, I thought it was worth getting this one because they had a real small one for 14 99 And I thought for a couple of quid more, obviously it depends where you want it, you know. You might want the smaller one. But I thought for a couple of quid more, I'm going to have the big one. I ain't got a bra on, and this is a bit gap here. You see my knockers, bloody hell. Don't mind that, will you? I'm fucking nipples are touching my legs. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> but yeah, not bad, so I'm gonna stand him next to my tree. I will vlog, like, putting the tree up and stuff, because I'm feeling very festive. I am. Um, the amount of trees that I've seen up already, and I just think, like, you know, get in the spirit, so, yeah. Got Santa, 16 I thought it was quite a bargain, really. This is the theme that I'm going. So pink and gold, and obviously a bit of silver as well, because I've got some silver ones. This was 7 99 
and I thought like you get a fair amount like for eight quid because you see them on Amazon and Argos and they can be quite pricey so yeah you get your style with it as well so uh yeah 7 dollars and I thought that weren't bad and I really like that colour so that's what I'm going to go for and then these were 3 .99. I really like them I thought for 6 3 .99, you know weren't too bad because like I said they had individual bows and stuff for 4 dollars and then this one as well um, which was 7 dollars so I'm excited because I just think like such a pretty combo you know I've never had a pink tree like pink um decorations so yeah I'm excited and then um I'll show you my tree in a sec but that's my decks I've got some tinsel and some smaller ball balls from Poundland so I'll show you them like tomorrow I'll get all them out but yeah I managed to get some pink tinsel so yeah I'm gonna put that up and um I got this as well listen this is in my Amazon basket for 35 pound and I've seen it for 19.99 so this is for Tyler so I'm gonna put that away for Christmas but I couldn't believe it because they collect stuff like this like all the trying to be a bit quiet but they collect like figures and spaceships and all that kind of thing and got a little shelf with it all on so they've got like a star wars shelf so i thought you know what 35 quid online all right it's like actually i went in tesco the other day and um i got mason for christmas it's harry potter wand it's with the invisi cloak that you can um it's got the wand with it the cloak and like you put an app with it it said 50 quid and i was like hmm, down to 12.50 so i got it because i thought 12.50 weren't bad you know you get a proper solid wand with it and i thought right i'm gonna have a google of this because i don't believe it was 50 quid it was not worth 50 quid at all so i only look and in selfridges it was 40 quid currently so yeah it's the harry potter invisi cloak and on amazon it was like 30 odd quid so i thought it was a bargain to get it like that 12.50 so i grabbed that you know and i just Put a little bit away. I had my camera on this, but this is my tree. So it is a, sorry, I'm showing it like this. That's what it looks like. But honestly, they had them out on display and it was like, um, what was it? Like the six foot and the seven foot. I've never had a seven foot tree, you see. And I thought it was beautiful, honestly. Stood up, it was stunning. So the six foot was 40 quid and the seven foot was, um, so I've paid 20 quid more for a foot extra, to be honest. But honestly, it was really tall and I just thought it was gorgeous. So with these um, decorations, you know, honestly, I stun it. And from Poundland as well, I've got these like um, snowflake window stickers and it, they're just stunning. So yeah, I'm going to stick all them up tomorrow. But yeah, gorgeous. So. But that is it. That's the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed it. I just thought I'd show you... Um, the decor and the bits and bobs that I got from um, Home Bargains. They've got so many different colours. I was tempted by green, um, navy blue, navy blue and white. I thought that was a stunning combination, but they didn't have anything like that. Like I said, there was only a few candy cane things. They'd been like wiped out. A lot of people have gone for the candy cane this year and it is stunning. I was very tempted, very tempted. And the Grinch, I'm sure, not in my store, but there was a Grinch that lights up like an inflatable one. So yeah, they didn't have any of that. I think it all sold out, but um yeah just honestly i can't wait to put it up and just surprise them because they've got no idea i keep saying no first of december first of december do you know what i mean so yeah i'm gonna surprise them tomorrow but that is it that's the end of the video i'm gonna go and take my face off now and get something to eat i had not any dinner yet so yeah anyway hope you're all right anyway you've had a nice day don't let any dickheads get you down all right you're fucking amazing no you're worth and i'll see you in tomorrow's video <laughs>